Have you ever wondered what actually happens when a bone breaks? Is it just a crack that magically glues back together? Or is your body running a complex repair factory behind the scenes? Today, we'll uncover the fascinating science of bone healing. And trust me, it's way cooler than you think. Hi, I'm Dr. Sohail, an orthopedic surgeon. On this channel, we break down complex medical science into clear, simple stories. If you're new here, hit subscribe because you'll never look at your bones the same way again. When a bone fractures, it's not just the bone that breaks. Blood vessels tear too. This creates bleeding inside the bone and surrounding tissue. Think of it as the body raising a red flag. Emergency. Repair needed. This pool of blood forms what we call a hematoma, the very first stage of healing. Next, the immune system sends in special cells, like little soldiers, to clean up the battlefield. They remove dead tissue and release growth factors. This is why fractures are often swollen, warm, and painful at first. Your body is literally preparing the ground for rebuilding. Now comes the scaffolding stage. Fibroblasts and chondroblasts, fancy names for repair cells, create a soft callus, a kind of biological glue made of collagen and cartilage. This is nature's temporary bridge between broken ends. But here's the catch. At this stage, the bone isn't strong yet, which is why casts and splints are so important. The soft callus then undergoes a magical transformation called endochondral ossification, where cartilage is replaced by real bone. A hard, bony callus now connects the fracture. This is the first time the bone starts to regain real strength. Finally, the remodeling stage. Over months, sometimes even years, bone reshapes itself according to the stresses placed on it. Osteoclasts break down excess material, and osteoblasts rebuild it stronger, smoother, and often almost identical to the original bone. Fun fact, in many cases the healed bone is actually stronger at the fracture site than before. Did you know children's bones heal almost twice as fast as adults? That's why kids bounce back so quickly after a fracture. Smokers and diabetics. Unfortunately, their healing is much slower because oxygen and nutrients can't reach the fracture as effectively. And here's the coolest part. Bone is one of the very few tissues in the body that can heal without a scar. So next time you hear the crack of a fracture, remember, your body is already activating an entire repair factory inside you. One, hematoma. Two, inflammation. Three, soft callus. Four, hard callus. Five, remodeling. That's the incredible science of bone healing. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button, share it with anyone curious about health and healing, and don't forget to subscribe for more orthopedic insights every week. Stay strong, stay healthy, and may your bones stay unbroken.